I know it has absolutely nothing to do with the beer's name, but every time I see blind pig on the shelves, I think of the nursery rhyme. Wrong animal, wrong subject, wrong whatever, but three blind pigs, three blind pigs. Well, enough of that already, but uh, hey, it's me, Matthew. Welcome to Chewing the Brew. Another episode. This is the 132nd beer review I have done. And this is Russian River Brewing Company's Blind Pig, which is an IPA. I do believe it's a West Coast IPA. And the bottle text is, Blind Pig is a prohibition era term for a speakeasy. Our very first brewery was named Blind Pig Brewing Company, which was located in Temecula, California. It was here that we first fell in love with IPAs and hops. Our Blind Pig IPA is a generously hopped with hints of citrus, woody notes, and a lingering bitterness. As one who has come to terms with the fact that I enjoy woody notes and hints of bitterness, or lingering bitterness, uh, those words make me happy. Yay! Uh, it is wonderful weather outside today, this mid-November afternoon, and I would be uh, recording this outside, except for the fact that I tried again to start a burn pile. I think it's failing again. Oh well, I tried again. Not enough gasoline. Um, and so everything's smoky outside. And I'm pretty sure this beer doesn't smell smoky, but that's probably all I would be able to smell <laughs> if I were anywhere outside at the moment. As it is, I still smell like smoke. I still smell like smoke. And uh, here's hoping that doesn't influence the beer too much. It pours a nice light, hazy golden color. That's pretty. It smells citrus, green. That's nice. It smells juicy. Um, it doesn't smell like overly hopped. It smells balanced. If you get deep down in there, there's possibly some melon. But it could also be um, uh, older navel oranges. Uh, I think as a navel, or as a navel orange uh, ripens and then over ripens and the, some of the cells get a little bit hard, it goes from a, a bright acidic sweetness. Some of that acidity seems to, to leach away and you're left with a softer sweetness. And that's kind of the... Uh, the, the smell that I'm picking up here. It smells good. It smells clean. It smells inviting. Let's uh, take a drink. Ooh, that's dry. So definitely citrus, yes. Um, if there's a woodiness, it's a green woodiness. Um, yeah, green, green woodiness, like green branches, not not dried, not um, not firewood, but fresh green branches still on the tree or fresh off the tree. The citrus is definitely navel, navel oranges, maybe the slightest hint of tangerine, but probably not. Mostly just kind of the gamut of navel oranges in different stages of ripeness. And then that green stick woodiness. And finally, yeah, there is a really nice, it's, it's not really strong. It's a very light, mild, subtle bitterness that is lingering in, in the finish. Far less than a lot of other beers. That's, that's very interesting. Um, it makes for a surprisingly delicate uh, flavor profile overall for an IPA, which is quite interesting. Something I am appreciating and enjoying. Good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so that's Blind Pig by Russian River Brewing Company out of California. Yet another great beer. Very good beers from that company. Anyways, this is me, Matthew. I'm enjoying the brew. I will catch y'all on the flip side.